All the paper and card you recycle is used to make paper-based packaging here in the UK. And all that starts right here at this paper mill in Snodland, Kent. The mill runs 24 hours a day, seven days a week, 365 days a year. Recycling in Kent for Kent. After your recycling is collected, the different materials get separated with 130 tonnes of paper and card arriving at this recycling depot each day. The team starts by removing anything that isn't paper or card by hand, otherwise it will contaminate the recycling. Plastics, polystyrene, wet paper and cardboard and even nappies have been found here and can only be removed manually. Sometimes the team has to deal with dangerous items too, putting them at risk. If all of these items are not removed, then whole loads of card and paper will get rejected. And this has financial and environmental impacts. The remaining card and paper is sorted and compressed into 800 kilogram bales. These bales are then transported to the mill where they'll be turned into reels of recycled paper. First, the bales travel up a conveyor belt to the top floor of the mill. The paper and card are mixed with water in this pulper, which acts like a huge food blender. 40 tonnes of paper is processed every hour. Now, your average piece of paper or card can be recycled approximately seven times before the paper fibres become too weak to be reused. But even then, they don't go to waste. The fibres are collected and the water is squeezed out, making a solid product. This gets used for things like composting, meaning 100% of the paper and card that arrives is recycled. The usable paper mixture is sprayed onto giant sheets of fabric and is put through a huge press, which squeezes out more water to make the sheet of paper exactly the right thickness or weight to make cardboard boxes. The pressed sheet then needs to be dried further in these huge ovens called dryers. The heat in this room is incredible and reaches up to 105 degrees. It's the heat that dries the wet sheet pulp into the final product. Starch is added at this point to give the paper strength. The paper is initially wound into huge reels, each weighing 35 tonnes, which is the equivalent of six adult elephants. And from here, it is cut down into smaller reels for the next stage. The whole of the paper making process is managed from this control room, where every single aspect of the system is tightly monitored. And importantly, the mill follows strict guidance set and monitored by the Environment Agency. So the vapour you see coming from the chimneys is steam, not smoke. The smaller reels then travel downstairs and are stored in this warehouse, ready to be taken across the UK to become corrugated cardboard and other paper-based products. It takes just one hour to produce a 35-tonne reel. So in 24 hours, this mill makes about 800 tonnes of paper and card. So there you have it. Put all of your card and paper in your recycling collection and it will be recycled and back in use in a couple of weeks. Kent Council's working together to keep Kent clean.